Good morning, everybody. This is Hob, and you are watching Church of Hob Gaming. Uh, so we're playing Space Engineers today, and um, we're uh, picking up our survival world today. Um, I had originally intended to run uh, in 45-minute intervals on my Space Engineers stream and edit the videos for upload to YouTube. I had some difficulty with my editing software, and I haven't been able to work out how to uh, how to correct that yet. So we're going to run probably about 50 minutes today, uh, and then I'm going to take a break. I've got some stuff I need to take care of, and then I think I'm going to set up to maybe stream uh, an older game uh, called Starflight, and I talked about that in, in my last stream, and how it had uh, been one of those pivotal games in uh, in my gaming uh, from when I was younger and um, I thought I'd show it to you guys and let you guys kind of check it out and, and get an idea of some of the games that I've played in the past and uh, I even thought that I might look at the possibility of streaming some other older games so uh, we'll see how that goes today uh, my goal really is going to be resource collection and building up a supply of um, of materials. Um, I have a couple of projects in mind that I want to do, uh, one of which is obviously going to be expanding the base and uh, the cargo capacity of the base, and the other is um, <clears throat> I found a couple of uh, a couple of scripts that I'd really like to look at for inventory management, so I'm going to need to build up some materials to make that worth doing. Uh, also, I, I had this cold this annoying, obnoxious, aggravating cold for like the past two weeks and I thought it was going away and it has yet again reared its ugly head. So bear with me if I'm coughing uh, and, and snuffling. Uh, unfortunately, this cold just does not seem to want to go away. Uh, on another note, my schedule at work is going to be changing. I'm not going to be streaming in the middle of the night for much longer. Uh, my stream's probably going to shift to a uh, an earlier in the day. Uh, stream. Also, I've been talking with another uh, another individual who does streaming who is uh, interested in, in maybe getting together to play some Space Engineers. Uh, so we may be doing a, uh, a multiplayer live stream in the uh, relatively near future. So keep an eye out for that. I'll let you know uh, when I have more details. Uh, but without further ado, uh, we're going to go ahead and get started. So let me switch the uh, sound back on here, and let's get to the game. Alright, so let's see. Where are we at? We are in our orange submarine in a tunnel. Alright, cool. So, what do we got by way of resources in this bad boy right now? Rocking and rolling. We got about half a container. So, oh yeah, that's right. I was gutting this thing. Uh, I think that I am going to skip the gutage of these asteroids more than necessary. I'm going to go hit this one, though. This one's got a couple of materials that I really, really need, one of which being uranium, the other being nickel. So I'm just going to plow right through this one. Hopefully it'll be worthwhile.
Let's go. <clears throat> Let's go hit this spot right here a couple of times, and then we'll go grab this nickel. And then I am gonna go hit a uh, a more lucrative uh, mining location. That I've already, that one of the ones that I I discovered in the in the last place. Let's go offload some of this. I don't think that we have a solid location to connect up at. Because I have been silly and haven't moved my port. Alright, so I guess we're going to fix that first. So let's power this down. Oops. <laughs> and we're just going to leave that bad boy parked right there. <clears throat> and we're going to move the connector. And I think I'm going to I think I'm going to extend it out right here. I'm just going to cut this wall off, bring the tube up and around. Maybe patch this 
up a bit. Seeing as how it was awfully beat to crap. Maybe give her a new coat of paint. I don't know about the paint though. Alright, so let's go. Grind it out. Alright, cool. I can't walk today, so that's always nice. Uh, interior plates. Twenty of those and twenty of those. So well there.
Hmm. Oh, I see, I see. We're gonna need a few more of those. Alright, let's go assemble some construction components, huh? Welder, the constructimator. Now I actually need to see what I need. What am I missing? Uh, construction components. That's construction components. Always in the construction components. We are flying in funny directions. And again, if we're not walking. All right, let's get the assembler producing. I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's grab as much of this as we can and we'll start shuffling it over to the refinery until the connector's up and running. <clears throat> that are not in Okay. 
There we go. Oh, there's another one right there. Seeing as how it's uh, like half chopped apart, and I keep cutting more off of it, I don't know. It's all fancy and cut to bits, you know. I don't know. Uh, probably just silly. Well, actually, I'm definitely just silly, but. That's beside the point. Right. I never did put a camera on the back of this. I really need to do that again. Alright, so power up. Because I'll tell you what, camera makes all the difference in the world in parking this beast. Well, I think I do pretty alright without one. And that will slowly unload into the refinery. And the refinery is an issue that I need to deal with as well, which is to say that there is not enough of it. I need to sort out how to oh, how to expand my refinery refining capabilities. And I could probably grind that gyroscope off of there too, seeing as how I'm not flying this beast anywhere. Save the world some power. Oh, apparently we're full. Most are taking the long way down. Great. Alright, where'd you go? Right in the hole. Well, at least it didn't fall all the way. Dang, we could have just kept on going. Alright, this gyroscope's gone. So 
wonder if there's a way. For us. To cut a refinery. Up against the back of this. That works. Now there's a camera on the back. That will make life easier. Yeah, it's a good deal. How's the inventory look? We are clear. So let's unpark this bad boy. Let's take a look at our uranium. And we're pretty good for the moment. Let's go to GPS. That was one of these that was just freaking perfect. And I think that it was this one. So we're going to go hit that. Uh, power everything up. Kill 
lights. And let's go for a ride. Or let's crash. Uh, hang on just a sec, guys. We just had a, uh, a game crash. Don't know what happened there. So, bear with me a minute. I'll get this fired back up. And we've only got a little bit longer left, but hopefully that saved most of what we had done. <clears throat> and unfortunately, I probably modded it until it broke. <laughs> I run way, 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 way too many mods. I can admit it, but I like my mods. Actually, I, I kind of have an addiction to them. I, I've said it before. I, I love the uh, the fact that the modifications that other people make uh, can enhance the game so significantly. Um, you know, I mean, something as simple as adding a uh, a, a conveyor tube that is flexible that connects around a corner uh, without being an actual corner so you can adjust it to an angle that's more specific to your needs uh, you know you can put a, a, a connector on the end of that and, and make it so that it, it points in exactly the right direction uh, somebody had wanted it for uh, joints for building mech uh, you know the fact that people can mod this game enough to build walking uh, mechs is fairly freaking awesome all on its own um, you know, and I, I, I just, I like playing with this stuff, and I, I've even toyed with the idea of maybe doing a, uh, a mod review, uh, where I'll download, uh, different modifications, uh, different mods for the game, and, uh, run them, uh, you know, and, and play with them, and show them to you guys, and, and then see what you guys think of them as well. And if that's something that you guys would like, definitely, you know, uh, let me know. You know, and if you like the the live stream, if you like anything that I have to say, if you enjoyed watching me goof around in Space Engineers and act like a dork, uh, please subscribe. Uh, follow me on Twitch. Follow me on YouTube. Uh, please follow me on Steam. Uh, you know, this is this is something that I really enjoy doing, and something that that I hope you guys enjoy me doing. Um, and uh, with uh, with that being said, uh, I also run, I also do a Diablo 3 live stream, um, and as I said earlier, I'm considering doing uh, classic games. I, I think it'd be a lot of fun to, to maybe pick up some of the classic game reboots that have been done, uh, you know, like the, the Final Fantasy 4 and that kind of stuff, and maybe even play some of the older, older classics and compare them side by side. Uh, I thought that could be, could be quite a bit of fun to do. Uh, well, we didn't too do, do too bad. The only thing we lost was, uh, well, taking the ship out. So, I can take that. Uh, but anyhow, as I was saying, I thought it would be a, a lot of fun to, to hit some of those reboots and, uh, and play some of those classic games. And, uh, let's double check the inventory, make sure that we are empty. We are. Um, so, we're gonna go ahead and and G and we're gonna put the camera back on here and we're gonna view and we're gonna go uh, oh, actually I wanna hit the control panel oh come on and I wanna go to inventory and I wanna look at the refineries Okay, that one is doing the uranium. Perfect. I think I'm going to pull 10 uranium out of here. And drop it in there. Oops. 
forgot my number lock was off. Alright. We'll just add that to that supply since we've got uranium processing here. Alright. P and lights. And V. We're just going to pull right back out again. I believe that was the hunk of junk that we were aiming for before. Let's grab this bad boy. Although it might have been, might have been that negative 4167. I don't rightly remember. So we'll go check this one out first. And if it wasn't this one, we'll go to the other one. No big deal. No harm, no foul. Got a fair amount of uranium to, to get where we're going. iron and magnesium this one has more that's why I think it was this one because I seem to recall that the one that I I found had a lot of resources that I needed I'm just gonna come coasting right on in here slide to a very handy stop. See there's that uranium right there. Look at that beautiful beautiful uranium. So I'm gonna come in here and get right up on this and I'm gonna switch views. So I have horrible depth perception in this game. Can't always tell how far from the exterior walls I am. All right, lights on, dampeners off, drills started, and we're just going to go very using two meters per second, and we're just going to coast. And this, this is the way that I like to mine. We just coast. No effort, little damage, doesn't use up any, uh, doesn't use up much in the way of resources except for what it takes to grind it out. And we just we watch our inventory and we watch to make sure that we don't bounce into anything. Every once in a while you'll bump a wall uh, or a protrusion before it gets mined out and that'll send you banging off into stuff and that can turn into a hazard and a hazard. But uh, as long as you're careful and pay close attention, you don't have too much trouble. Oh, pretty good. Should be able to take a fair bit of this out pretty darn quick.
think we'll go to... Oh, I think we'll go to 40k if we can get away with it on this run, on this strip, and then we'll go, uh, we'll see about grabbing some, uh, some silicon, and, oh, let's go on this, let's get some hunk of rock, uh, some cobalt, and I'll probably collect iron at base, just because there's an epic ton of it on that starting asteroid. slam into anything so there's a uh, there's a new mod that I'm actually the, that I want to try it's uh, somebody uploaded it it's a, uh, a collector that actually has its own gravity I'm thinking what I want to do is I want to put uh, put them on uh, towards the back of the mole and in a position so that there's one on top bottom and each side so that we can actually, oh, yep, we sure did, we hit the side, so let's uh, back out of here, let's see if we can adjust our viewing angle, there we go, I'm just going to move over a hair and come down just, just a bit, alright, let's go back to that. But anyhow, it's it's supposed to have a, a a very light gravity that doesn't affect players, but only affects materials, which I thought would be really, which of course would, is specifically for mining purposes. We're just uh, we did we ban we bounced around a bit more than I thought in there. Let's just give a quick inspection for damage. Since we were banging on the sides of the wall there a little bit, I didn't think we'd have any, and it doesn't look like we do. Alright, cool. So, let's do this. And let's go. Let's go hit that cobalt, I think. Alright, so kill the lights here. Oh, actually, you know what? I think I'm going to hit that silicon first. I never have enough of that. Yeah, 
this will pack in 30k of this as well if there's enough material right in front of us to do it which it certainly looks like there is uh, we'll pop back out and grab some cobalt and then I saw some platinum down there so we're gonna hit that as well while we're at it and that'll give us uh, give us a good start on that and then uh, gonna need to track down some more nickel uh, magnesium always with the iron all right we have reached 30k let's let the drills finish up here and we're just gonna back right on out all nice and gentle like Looks like that cobalt might actually be on the exterior. So let's go look at that. It might just be buried in a weird spot. Oh, hey, there's some nickel down here too. Kill a couple of birds. A couple of birds. Ah, oh, there it is. There's some cobalt. Is it's in a weird spot. Doesn't look like there is a whole ton of it here, though. But we'll uh, we'll take what we can get. I guess it could have gotten closer. <laughs> stay at 0.2 meters per second. There's a nickel down there, so we'll just swing right down and around. I 
think I'm going to aim in the general direction of the platinum just for shits and giggles. So, we and we and home and forward at a snail's pace. Perfect. 